So, y'all, this is the engine bay of the 2004 Grand Prix GT that I own. I have just spent about a good hour or two cleaning up the engine bay some. Um, I will have before and after pictures of it. Um, I mainly most focused on what I could get to without uh, disassembling a lot of stuff. So, for example, I removed these bars, the sway bars, uh, the lining up there. Sorry, this is being recorded on my phone. Um, let's see. I cleaned up the hoses for the radiator. Well, best I could. I can't really get to the one down there. Um, I'm just going to straight up replace all these. I know it's not needed, but I really can't see myself trying to clean all that because I don't know how to. If anyone has any suggestions, let me know in the comment description. Not comment. In the comment section. Oi. <clears throat> Um, completely cleaned all the way down. I uh, cleaned up my air intake box some. I also cleaned up the hood. Nice and shiny again. Uh, if anyone can tell me where I can get the... This piece right here for the hood, let me know. Once again, in the comment section below. Uh, what I wound up using was microfiber gloves. And, surprise, surprise, it got rid of the white lithium grease I couldn't get rid of. Crown Spray Power All-Purpose Multi-Surface Cleaner. I mean, this brought it all up instantly. Especially the uh, white lithium grease that got oversprayed when I was looping up the uh, gears inside of here. So, I also now have a brand new oil dipstick. It's a little hot, but... The old one is just trashed. The handle broke off. Uh, bought that on Amazon. Uh, let's see. Be surprised. Oi! Not in there. I need to take the cover off. I mean, it's not the best job I can do. I was running out of time, but imagine all this just... Here's an example of what it used to look like down here. I don't feel safe trying to clean that out, that section. Too close to the spark plugs for my liking to try and clean it myself. So, yeah. That stuff was caked on for a long time. Uh, we'll be cleaning up the battery terminals next, uh, which will be another day. Because my time is up. I have to work tomorrow. Ouch. And I have to clean up. My hands are filthy. As you can see. Um, I eventually plan on replacing the shock strut assemblies. All four of them as well as the last three remaining wheel hubs. And lastly I plan on replacing... Uh, don't know if I can see in there. Let's see, do I got a light on here? Uh, the tensioner pulley thing. The uh, pulley is worn out, so, not the pulley, but the bearings inside the wheel in here, they're worn out. Um, but yeah. This is what, two hours of scrubbing with microfiber cleaning gloves and a busted up toothbrush can get you. If I had the proper equipment, I would make this entire engine bay look brand new. Uh, let's see, I'm not sure if I got this, I'll show it to you real quick. Um, there's the braking assembly, the master cylinder and all that good stuff. Completely cleaned it to where, see, you can once again see the full line. So, uh, tell me what you all think of my half-assed cleaning job on this. And tell me what you'd like to see next. Once again, this is a, another video from Internals Information Technology Group. I hope you all have a pleasant day. Uh, one last thing. I just gotta do some touch-ups on this, but the plastic restore did its job. And this plastic looked the same color as paint job, so that would tell you it worked good. I'll see you all later. Let's see, how do I... Ah, here we are.